What's up, homie? This is Scott, and this video is a tutorial to show you how to back up your entire YouTube channel. I'm talking about all your videos, all your titles, all your descriptions, all your tags, and all your live streams in one central download location. You're gonna love this. Now, if you're new to my channel and you produce video at your desk with a PC computer, you have come to the right channel. I provide information in regards to editing software, YouTube strategy, and information on OBS Studios all the time here at this channel. If you like what you hear, click subscribe and the bell for a new video notification. Yeah. Now, it is not a coincidence that I'm making this video right now. I'm hearing a lot of word on the street in regards to some form of a channel purge that is coming in just a few weeks. So, uh, I'll tell you right now, Dr. P has told me some information that makes me think that there's gonna be a purge. He also let me know that Instagram is gonna have a purge. He let me know that Facebook is going to have a purge in January. So it seems to me like there is a general trajectory of some form of a channel purge in the near future. I'm going to give you the date that I was told at the end of this video so that you are prepared. So I'm gonna give you the tools necessary to back up your channel, and then I'm gonna let you know what the deadline is. This ne the next few minutes of this video could potentially save you major headache down the road. So let's get started. Okay, the first step in backing up your YouTube channel is to go to the right website. The URL of the site is called takeout, one word, dot google dot com. And upon arriving here, you will see a section called select data to include. Make sure that you deselect all and scroll down to the bottom of this page and select YouTube. The reason why I say this, you don't want to really check off any of the other data, is because this archive is going to be big. If you've been around YouTube for a while, you have a lot of live streams, you've uploaded more than 50 videos, expect an archive that exceeds 50 gigabytes. It's going to be big. So select that and click next step. Now you want to click create archive. Now I got to tell you, upon clicking this, it's going to go out and grab all the data, all the videos, everything. It's going to take almost a day for this to occur. So after clicking that button, you'll see here it says an archive of your YouTube data is currently being prepared. Please note that the archives may take a long time, hours, possibly days. I'm leaning towards days, at least 24 hours if you have a lot of data in your YouTube channel. You will receive an email when your archive is complete. So make sure that you come back and revisit this page from time to time, if the email on your YouTube account is not active, pop back in here just to make sure that things are uh, copacetic and make sure that the archive has been created. So it's a waiting game, but you gotta do it. Upon your archive being created, click Manage Archives, and it will give you a little summary. In my case, it says that the archive is YouTube and 170 gigabytes is the size of my archive. It says that it was created on November 22nd, and I have until November 29th to download that archive. Now, the reason why is it takes a lot of damn storage to store these things, and I imagine storage costs money, and Google isn't in the business to store these massive files, so they eventually, I guess, delete them. So you have a specific amount of time. You got to get to work and get it done. Click the Show Archives button, and it will give you a full list of all the split files that comprise the archive. They can't give you a single download link because if anything gets interrupted with the download, you'll lose the whole thing. So it would make it very difficult to download the entire file. That's why they break these up. In order to keep track of what you're doing, you're gonna have to have a piece of paper. I call mine the YouTube archive download record. This system is fairly archaic. It really doesn't let you know when you successfully downloaded a file, it's pretty stupid. You click the download button, it downloads, and that's it. That's all it tells you. It doesn't tell you what successfully downloaded. That's why you need one of these sheets right here. I made this myself. It gives me a full record of all the files that exist, okay? And when I click the download button, I put a dash. That lets me know that I've already clicked the download, and when it successfully downloads to my computer, I put an X. That's what this is. And I will put a link. This is a PDF that I created. I will put a link to this PDF so that you can print it at your house so that you can keep track of what you've downloaded to your computer. Without this, you're going to get lost. I guarantee it. Because you're not going to be able to do this in one fail swoop. You're going to probably leave your desk and come back. And you'll forget what you've downloaded. And, you, for, you know, it gets confusing real quick. 
Upon the files downloading to your computer, you will receive both video files and zip files. It's purely up to you if you want to extract them to your computer. The meta information is stored in JSON files. You're going to need a third party program to gain access to that information. I can tell you with confidence that if you do open the JSON files, you will see that information in there. Something is coming down the pike. You can feel it and I can feel it. They would have made changes to the terms of service in regards to your specific channels not being commercially viable. They would not have put that language in there if something wasn't coming down the pike. The COPPA fiasco is another part of it something is coming i was told by my connection that it is december 10th so to be safe i want you to consider that a hard deadline get your youtube channel backed up by december 10th do, do not, not wait. wait get it done now i did a pretty decent video on the coppa law broke down some facts and some opinion i think you'll really enjoy it click it right here check that out Remember now, back up that website, stay strong and keep fighting, and get some!